Hi guys, Ms. Rowan is here and I'm going to talk about the T-chart, okay, in UOI when it comes to grouping beneficial actions and harmful actions, okay? When I say T-chart, it's like, you know, letter T. So you will see a T line, right, like this. And then on the other side, you will put the other group. On, on the other side, you will put the other group. For example, we are talking about beneficial and harmful actions. So that means we have to group them either beneficial means good and harmful which is bad okay now first of all before we go to t-chart and uh, using it how to group beneficial actions and harmful actions let's have a recap of what is beneficial or harmful okay so beneficial is something good and then harmful is something bad now you tell me first you can answer um right there okay with your mom or dad whisper it to them what your answer is okay as you can see in the picture is this beneficial or harmful it's harmful to cut trees right next one is it beneficial or harmful it's beneficial to throw your rubbish properly in the bin very good. Next one. How about recycling? It's beneficial. Perfect. Okay, next one. How about noise pollution? Like using the honks improperly. Is it beneficial or harmful? It's harmful. Okay, great. Next one. How about turning off the faucet or the tap when you're not using it? Is it beneficial or harmful? It's beneficial. Great. Okay, next. How about the air pollution? The smoke uh, coming out from the factories. Beneficial or harmful? Harmful. Perfect. Next one. How about... Oopsie daisy. How about... Okay, great. More time. How about throwing rubbish in the sea or in the bodies of water? Beneficial or harmful? Harmful. Perfect. Next one. How about cleaning the beach? See what they're doing? They're picking up the rubbish along the seashore. Beneficial. Perfect. How about washing your hands properly? And you have to make sure that the faucet is off or you close it. Beneficial or harmful? Beneficial. Very good. Okay, next one. How about playing with your food? Wow. Some people, they don't have enough food to eat, you know? So you have to be thankful and you have to... Um, eat and you don't throw food get enough of food all right on your plate you don't throw it and play with it when you play with it is it beneficial or harmful it's harmful how about when you clean up when you tidy beneficial or harmful beneficial perfect next one this time, okay, we are going to try using the T-chart, just like what I've told you in the beginning. So, T-chart, just like what I've said, it's like a T that has two columns or two sides in which you put the other group and the other group. This time, we're going to group beneficial actions and harmful actions, okay? On the screen, you will see some pictures, okay? And you have to tell me if they are beneficial or harmful so you have to keep them on the right places okay all right there you go now how about this picture where should we put them in the beneficial side or on the harmful side beneficial how about this where does it go 
Okay, harmful. Good job. How about this one? Planting trees. Is it beneficial or harmful? Beneficial. Perfect. Next one. How about this honk? Yeah, it's harmful. Okay, next one. How about recycling? Beneficial or harmful? Beneficial. Perfect. Throwing rubbish everywhere? Yes, it's harmful. Good job. How about watering the plants or the vegetables? It's beneficial. Perfect. How about the smoke in the factories? Yes, it's harmful. Okay, so there you go, guys. So you have already seen how to use T-chart in which you have to group actions that are beneficial and harmful. Thank you so much. Bye. Mwah.